So just try to come up with a username. If your username is taking up, you can go ahead and choose one of the ones that it suggested to you. So for example, right here, it's telling me Tekken Design Channel 9 is not taking up, but I can try 2022 and see what happens. So that, that works. Now down here below, you can go ahead and put in a password that you will remember or make your computer select one for you. Again, you should remember. So I'm gonna put in show password. And again, you want a password that's kind of difficult. So I'm gonna zoom in on mine so you guys can see. Again, it's not the best password. This can definitely be better, but as a password, it's good enough. So I'm just gonna go into next. Now you have to verify your phone number. So you can go ahead and put it in. Now, if this doesn't make sense to you, just go and select whichever country you're from and then just verify. So in my case, it's 647. I'm gonna put 491, 70, 18. By the way, if you guys use my phone number, it's not gonna work. You have to use your own phone number. So going to next. All right, so I'm just gonna zoom in a little bit and the verification code that I got by text is this right here. Your verification code will be different. So this will not work for you guys. Just press on verify on the bottom right hand side. Now you're gonna get into this page where you guys can put a recovery email. I highly suggest putting that, but if you don't have another email, don't worry about it. Just skip over, put your birthday. Then go into the next step, gender. You can choose whatever you like. I will put male. And then if I keep going down, I can just go right into next on the bottom right hand side. Once you press next, you're gonna see this. Now let me zoom out just a little bit. Now right here, you can add a phone number if you like, but if you don't want to, you don't have to. So let's just press skip on the bottom left hand side. Now this part, just scroll down and you're gonna see all the way down here, it says agree. Just press agree in the middle. And you will notice, although we're signing up for a Gmail account, we're making a Google account. So right here is everything. So I'm done. I can just put don't switch for now. So once again, right here, this is my Gmail. So if you go all the way back to Google, you're gonna notice this on the top right hand corner of your screen, you're gonna see the T and you can see that you have a Google account already. So this is my Google account, that's my email and I'm all set. Now, if I decide to go into YouTube on the other hand, I can just tap on sign in on the top right hand corner and it's gonna sign me in right now. So I have a YouTube account as well. See that T again, I can click on it, it's gonna see my email, and I'm done. I just created three accounts all in one. So that's why I said when I started the video, no matter what you create, you're kinda of creating everything all at once. So I have a YouTube account, I have right there, a Google account plus a Gmail. So let's say I wanted to upload videos and all that stuff, I can go right into YouTube Studio. So once I click there, it's gonna take me here where I can go ahead and upload a picture up here for my YouTube channel, I can pick a name that I want. It doesn't have to be your Gmail name, you can change it up. So what I'm gonna do is just add a space, my handle, this is very important, just choose a handle that makes sense to you guys. And then on the bottom right hand corner, you're gonna see create channel, just press right there, and you're gonna create your channel. Again, this is only if you guys want to. Just press on continue in the middle, and you can start uploading all your stuff. Let me just zoom in a little bit. On the top right hand corner, I'm gonna see that T again, let me just close that up. And I'm gonna see this arrow to upload videos, I can go live stream, or you can press create. It all takes you everywhere. So all these options do almost the same thing. So if I press on create, I can just go ahead, press upload videos, and I can start uploading videos to my own YouTube channel. Now if you guys would like to customize more stuff about your YouTube channel, you can go ahead and do that. However, if you don't want to, you just have your channel right there, you just wanna make maybe playlists, like videos and comment on videos, you can start doing that right now without doing any setup for your own YouTube channel. But as far as this video goes, we're all done. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.